The K2 Black Panther. This cutting-edge main battle tank stands as a pinnacle of technological advancement, embodying the epitome of power and precision on the battlefield. Renowned for its sleek design and unparalleled combat capabilities, the K2 Black Panther has earned its place as a true titan of contemporary warfare. The decision to develop the K-2 Black Panther arose from a strategic imperative to modernize the South Korean armed forces and equip them with a tank capable of meeting the challenges of contemporary warfare. With this in mind, a consortium of South Korean defense contractors embarked on an ambitious journey to design and build a tank that would surpass all predecessors in terms of firepower, mobility, and protection. At the heart of the K-2 Black Panther's design lies its formidable CN-08 120mm 55 caliber smoothbore gun, a weapon renowned for its accuracy, range, and penetrating power. This advanced main armament ensures that the K-2 Black Panther can engage and neutralize enemy targets with devastating precision. In addition to its firepower, the K-2 Black Panther boasts impressive speed and mobility, thanks to its state-of-the-art propulsion system and innovative design features. This agility allows the tank to maneuver swiftly across diverse terrain, enabling it to outmaneuver adversaries and seize the initiative on the battlefield. However, the path to the development of the K2 Black Panther was not without its challenges. The project faced numerous technical hurdles and logistical complexities, requiring relentless innovation and perseverance to overcome. Yet, through unwavering dedication and ingenuity, the South Korean defense industry succeeded in bringing the K-2 Black Panther to fruition, setting a new standard for armored warfare in the 21st century. First and foremost, the K-2 Black Panther's armor is a marvel of defensive engineering. Utilizing advanced composite materials and modular design principles, the tank's armor provides exceptional protection against a wide range of threats, including armor-piercing projectiles, anti-tank missiles, and improvised explosive devices. This robust armor ensures the survivability of the crew and critical systems in high-threat environments. Equipped with the formidable CN-08 120mm 55 caliber smoothbore gun, the K-2 Black Panther possesses unmatched firepower. This main armament is capable of engaging and neutralizing armored vehicles, fortifications, and other high-value targets with pinpoint accuracy and devastating effect. Additionally, the tank is outfitted with a suite of secondary weapons, including a coaxial machine gun and a remote-controlled weapon station, further enhancing its offensive capabilities. The K-2 Black Panther operates with a crew of three personnel, a commander, a gunner, and a driver. Each crew member performs specialized tasks essential for the tank's combat effectiveness. The commander coordinates tactical operations, the gunner aims and fires the main gun, and the driver maneuvers the tank across varied terrain with precision and agility. In terms of speed and mobility, the K-2 Black Panther is unmatched in its class. Powered by a high-performance engine and featuring advanced suspension and transmission systems, the tank boasts impressive speed and agility on both roads and rough terrain. Have a speed of 70 km per hour or 43 miles per hour this exceptional mobility enables the K2 Black Panther to swiftly maneuver into position, outmaneuver adversaries, and exploit tactical advantages on the battlefield. With regard to range, the K2 Black Panther's fuel-efficient engine and large internal fuel capacity provide an impressive operational range, allowing for extended missions without the need for frequent refueling. With a range of 450 kilometers or 280 miles this extended range enhances the tank's versatility and endurance in prolonged combat scenarios. Since its introduction, the K-2 Black Panther has seen significant production numbers, with 410 K-2 Black Panther tanks produced. Numerous units deployed within the South Korean military and exported to allied nations. This widespread adoption is a testament to the tank's exceptional performance and reliability, solidifying its status as a cornerstone of modern armored warfare. Despite its impressive capabilities, the K-2 Black Panther is not without its limitations. One potential downside is its complexity and maintenance requirements. The advanced technologies and systems integrated into the tank demand meticulous maintenance and skilled personnel for optimal performance. Additionally, the high cost of production and maintenance may pose logistical challenges for some military budget. One notable variant is the K-2PL, 
or the K2 Black Panther Poland, which is a customized version tailored specifically for the Polish Armed Forces. This variant incorporates enhancements to suit the requirements of the Polish military, including modifications to communication systems, battlefield management capabilities, and interoperability with other NATO forces. The K2PL variant also features advanced technologies for improved situational awareness and enhanced survivability, making it a formidable asset on the modern battlefield. The K-2 Black Panther has left an indelible mark on the landscape of tank design and military strategy, shaping the future of armored warfare in profound ways. Its innovative technologies and advanced capabilities have set new standards for modern tanks, influencing the development of armored vehicles worldwide. Beyond its role in modern warfare, the K-2 Black Panther's influence extends to broader military strategy and defense doctrines. Moreover, the K-2 Black Panther serves as a symbol of South Korea's commitment to technological innovation and military modernization. Its successful development and deployment demonstrate the nation's capability to produce world-class defense systems and contribute to international security efforts. While the K-2 Black Panther is primarily operational in active military service, several examples are preserved in museums around the world. Comment below of what thing I should talk about next and subscribe for more.